Good evening. Spent all day Saturday evening playing with this radio and uh, well the mystery is still there. As you can see I've got a signal generator down there. It's a bit of an antique but uh, it's producing a 20 kilohertz signal with a 400 hertz modulated uh, AM signal. Uh, you can hear it. on 21 megahertz which means the dual conversion is working and you can see the uh, perfect sine wave coming out straight after the diode that modulates it there you go that's the um, detector diode and you can see where the signal is connected right after it right before it rather um, and it's a beautiful sine wave 360 326 hertz sine wave being modulated on a transmit generated frequency at 21 megahertz so all that looks good so the radio should be working right well watch this Okay, so now let me show you what this audio really looks like. It looks like the bottom half of the, the audio is being truncated or something. So let's go look at the signal before the, the, the detector, which would be... There. And uh, well, you can see I have a rather noisy signal. Let me keep going, wait till you see my transmit signal. Pretty good. Looks pretty good to me. That's a pretty good, well modulated signal before the detector diode. And after the detector diode, We get a beautiful 326 hertz audio signal. <sighs> well, the mystery continues. So why does my signal generator, which is connected to the aerial, running at 21 megahertz and a 400 hertz tone work perfectly, but what I'm actually picking up outside seems to be totally distorted. I have no idea. Let's try some other bands.
I don't I don't seem to be getting the bottom half of the the wave. Maybe the detector diode is playing out. Although, let me switch to AM and see what happens. So I'm getting beautiful AM. I'm getting my 21 megahertz tone beautifully sent. It's just anything on the shortwave seems to not be picking up. I, maybe the oscillators are out of whack. <laughs> 